Hey guys, it's Miss Carrier. I am coming to you from my patio, enjoying this pretty weather today and trying to teach virtually from home during the coronavirus. I promised my staff that now that some of them are working from their Chromebooks and only have Balfour Go available, that I would show them how to upload content uh, directly into that. It's a little bit different than what you're used to if you're using the Studio Works software. So if there are any advisors out there that want to use this to show your staffers a little tutorial on how to do that, you are more than welcome to. All right, so I have loaded the software. If I go directly to uh, studio.balfour.com, um, you can launch StudioWorks and it'll open up with the Balfour Go software. Um, and so you're gonna see that it's a little bit different. If I go to, I'm gonna have to minimize this to be able to show you here. Um, but if I go to the software and I want to import a picture like I normally would, and let's say that that picture is on the desktop, I am not going to see any pictures from there, okay? Let me go over here to my email. I'm going to download a picture just to show you. So this is a mom that has sent me a photo for her son's senior ad. I'm going to save this photo as P. Finkel 3. Notice that on my desktop, I already have P. Finkel 1 and 2. I'm going to add 3 there. Okay. And when I go back to my software, uh, again, nothing shows up on my desktop. Okay. If I went to import that, um, nothing would be there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this little cloud right here, which is a virtual holding spot for any photos that you need to upload into your content. So I'm going to upload files here. I've already uploaded the, the image two, so now I'm going to go ahead and upload the image three, P. Finkel three, into this holding area, and it says that now the file has been uploaded. So they're there, it's just a little bit harder to find. So when I go to add the file, instead of going straight to the desktop, I'm now going to, uh, let's see, go all the way down in the file hierarchy until you see mainframe Two. At least that's what it shows on my computer. And now from the mainframe, I'll see a folder of uploads. And that's where I'm going to uh, go in and find the file that I need to upload, which in this case, it's Pfinkle 3. I'm going to click OK, and then I'm going to click Upload One File. And that'll look like what you're used to um, from your previous uploads. I'm also actually, oops, I'm going to lose my computer power going to go ahead and do that one more time to show you how to um, scroll down to the mainframe and I'm going to upload the spec photo that has not actually been heard. So P. Finkel 2, again you upload the file just like you normally would have. And so now I have all three images available to me to use within um, those senior ads uh, online. So I hope this you today. I hope that you are all doing well across the U.S. Um, as you are trying to finish your books. I know we have a lot to do, but we've got a plan, and I hope that these books are books that are cherished forever as we are truly making history this year. Please stay safe and stay healthy. Bye for now.